In this first video, we're going to take a quick look at the Illustrator Creative Cloud workspace. So we begin, and here we can see an Illustrator file open. But if we were creating a new file, we would come to File, New, and we see this new document panel. There's a lot of different options in here. I'm just going to go over them very briefly. One, we can add, change the number of artboards. We can give our project a name and we can look and see how we want to set this up. I'm just going to keep this at custom and I can change this to inches, picas, millimeters, pixels, and just keep this standard 8.5 by 11, hit OK, and there we have our new document. As we look around Illustrator, we can see that we have uh, our big one will be our tools window, our tools panel, and we have all of these other floating windows. Now, we can reset our workspace if we'd like to. We're going to keep this at Essentials. And we can see this is what we have. Now, any of these little floating windows that we see, we can turn them on and turn them off by coming up to our menu and coming to Window. And so I have my swatches open. If I wanted to close my swatches, I would just unclick it. My swatches are gone. I could also turn things off by clicking the little X and a lot of times we'll, we will do that just to uh, create more space. Now, I can also come in and tear off my little windows. And if I want to add them together, I can take and just drop it in and stack them all in together. So I can even grab my color and you know put them all in together. And again, another reason just to um, you know save space as you work. So there we have it, an overview of the Illustrator Creative Cloud Workspace. This is your artboard where all of your designs take place. And this area around it, um, you know, we could say is the, so is the area around your artboard, which you can also place things into. When I want to come in, I'll come to this one, I want to save a file. I come on up, File, Save As, and we get our little Save As window. And we have a couple options in our Save As window. Uh, we can save as a .ai file, which is the native Illustrator file. We can also save as a .pdf file. Um, and here we have it. Okay, so we come on in and we can see we have AI, which is the native Illustrator file, and EPS, AIT, which is a template, um, SVG, SVGZ. Uh, I'm going to save this one as a PDF. I would save it as a PDF uh, because I can actually send it to other people who do not have um, Illustrator uh, installed. So I'm going to save this and save PDF. And there we have it. Thanks for listening. Quick overview and intro to the Illustrator workspace.